Uh, so what's the, what's the plan now for for Randy? Any uh, uh, plan uh, to fight anytime soon, or what's uh, you know what's your plan? He's 28 years of age. Obviously, he trains with Sandman and JC's also his co-manager. So I'll talk to JC, see what he thinks. But obviously, once COVID restrictions lift, we've got to get him a tune-up fight where he comes in and you know he gets some rust out and he gets a win and and he gets himself back feeling good and then maybe see how he performs in that fight. If he performs well, mm -hmm. maybe fight a rated fighter. If he doesn't perform well, maybe give him another fight till he finds his form. Because a loss to a fighter, it, it doesn't matter. Some take it well. Manny Pacquiao takes it awesome. He's good when he has a loss. He bounces straight back. Some fighters, it takes a fight or two to bounce back. Mm -hmm. They lose the confidence. But I think Randy, after he lost Alvarado, he bounced back pretty good with his two fights. So I, I think he'll be okay. And I think he's got two, three more years left of boxing. By the time he gets, he's only 28, as we mentioned. 28's pretty young now to be a boxer. Yeah. So uh, I, think he's I'm got, mm -hmm. I think he's got a bit left. I think he's okay. got a bit left. I, I think he's got a few years left. He's not done yet. Okay, definitely. It's, it's still, I mean, man, he's 40 years old and a lot of boxers, 35 years old, still doing very well. So, but uh, I'm curious, how did how did uh, how were you able to uh, start managing a Filipino boxer like um, Randy? I'd, I'd how go did you to get the him? fights, and then I'd meet people. I remember I was involved with uh, Belweg Bengoyan early on. Um, mm -hmm. It was a super band and based out of D Dubbo. And uh, and then one time I went to Carlos Tamara and Brian Valoria. I was covering the fight, and Randy yeah. fought. Marlon to Palace on the undercard, and uh, I got to meet him there, and and um, it sort of snowballed. Found out who his manager was, stuff like that, and then I, I got involved. I think he was only about 18 or 19. He lost to Marlon to Palace. Uh, he got TKO, but in the first round he, he went really well. Uh, but I think he was just too small. Marlon to Palace is so big and strong, yeah. and he overwhelmed yeah. Randy. But at the time, Randy was undefeated, and I liked the fact that. He fought someone like Marlon to Palace and he was so young and you could see the speed and the skills and there was so much to work with and I, I was I, you know I wanted to work with him I thought he had potential 